All right, another City Builder Empire Builder game. Hello again there, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome to Pax Nova, a game available now on Steam that I just found out about, and I want to give a try. If you love games like Civilization VI and even Old World and games such as uh, Planetfall, then this will definitely be the game for you. We've done a lot of Empire and City Builder games recently on the channel, and this one is no different, as I really like it, but I have Nova idea what it's all about. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'll be here all week. Well, thank you, everybody, for smashing that like button. Welcome to all the new subscribers subscribers and thank you very much for becoming members too by clicking and tapping that wonderful join button well let's go ahead and see what this game is all about then you can get this one on steam too by the way so make sure you check steam for offers on this game uh, which is available now we're playing version 1.0 so anything that's not uh, working correctly will probably be updated soon but as you can see there's many different nations to choose from or factions to choose from as we have some from earth but also some from other planets and different worlds where they have all sorts of different backgrounds and ways that they operate and whatnot but we're going to go ahead and make our own because we want to be raptoria so glory to raptoria down below in that comment section and let's go ahead and get started our faction name will be Raptoria. Our description will be, uh, let's see, uh, Glory to Raptoria. And the leader's name, of course, will be Raptor. Excellent. Well, it's cool that we have our own uh, look to it. Uh, I guess this kind of looks like me right now. I haven't shaved in a while, so the eastern guy that you saw uh, behind there with the uh, leather jacket and the, the beard and such looks appropriate. Let's find a flag for ourselves, though it's not too important. Let's try to find something that uh, somewhat uh, describes me. This kind of looks good. Let's go with a blue-like flag. And let's see. Oh, that actually looks really nice. Let's go with blue on that. And that should be good. Excellent. So what does our uh, traits have? We have edit traits, prosperity gains, worldwide bonus of one. Oh, that actually seems quite good. What else is there? Is there a way for, like, more exploring or something? A income capital increases by 10. Uh, let's do something like uh, improve trust with all factions by 4. There we are. We're going to be trustworthy. And look at all of these bonuses that we can get, too. So you can make all your own sort of uh, b beneficial things, I guess. City Architects, let's go with that one. Effective Builders, let's go with that one. We should also pick a negative, too. Let's say uh, uh, Eugenics, Xenophobics, Lousy Fighters, Anxious. Let's go with uh, uh, Ineffective Logistics. No, let's go with uh, Lousy Fighters, I guess. Yeah, we're going to be bad at fighting. But we'll still have some sort of, uh, I guess... Uh, benefits to us as well you can actually oh you can actually make it three out of three and then uh, negative one okay very good so we got our three we're human we're lousy fighters that all seems fine to me exclusive technologies let's say we are very good at uh let's see oh actually would this cancel that out if we had dead eye uh let's see ray damage weapon ship class does 105 damage uh let's see what might help us out at the start uh let's see cadet schools land license certified workforce maybe that'll help us out a little bit uh, early and later game is how they're separated. Okay, let's confirm. Now, if there's a lot going on, hold on. The game's about to get started now, so let's go ahead and save and begin as we leave Earth. Earth has been destroyed, and now we're basically finding a new planet to settle, so that way we can begin humanity yet again. So let's go ahead and start as we do that now. The Terran Republic conglomerate once it was once it whatever it once was. That's totally fine. All right, let's go ahead and get started. And uh, let's see, this is all good to me. Looks like we can change all these other things if we want to. We can also go to war with other planets, and that's pretty cool too. So we can settle one planet, take it over completely, and then go settle another one. The Terran Republic is a conglomerate of what remains of once, uh, what was once known as the Western Civilization. Countless wars and constant civil unrest caused huge rifts and nearly caused it to scatter, with Earth's slow demise looking like it would be the final nail in the coffin. Despite being a shadow of once, what it once was, the Republic survived and is still a force to be rep reckoned with. Now led by the charismatic Chancellor Wynne, and with the chance to start over, the future is looking up. So basically, Jeff Bezos and all of the shareholders launched into space as Earth imploded. Looks like there's a guy here, like, collapsed on his knees. Like, the, the Earth must be exploding or imploding or something like that as people are looking with anguish, comforting family members, and someone else doing some data reports down here. Quite nice, I guess. So, again, there's different factions in the game. So our faction seems to be from Earth, many others from other planets. Let's go ahead and take a look here. Oh, wow. This must be the uh, planet that we left. And it says launch alert, so it looked like a missile just launched out of there, so that was our spacecraft. We had to leave Earth behind as it had no future. Now that we've finally arrived to our destination and preparing to take the rest of our crew out of cryostasis, we have no time to look back at those we left behind and the fate of our homes. We can only look ahead to what awaits us now. We don't know what dangers and mysteries we'll be facing, 
but we have no other choice other than to be prepared. Let's begin. Approaching Di Dianus 1. Dianus 1. Yes, well, that's, that's great. Better than Earth, I guess. And it is a desert planet. Okay, so we're settling on Dune, I guess. Cool. New Quest, Chapter 1, The Arrival. Now that we've finally arrived in Eos and landed in a new planet suitable of living conditions, we can finally start thinking about settling down. We've been given the chance to start over, and we shall make the most of this opportunity. First objective, settle your colony. Awards to Aether. Okay, let's go ahead and check on that. Welcome to Pax Nova. It can be a complex game, and the tutorial's purpose is to guide you through the various features. Great. Okay, perfect. Now, let's go ahead and explore a little bit and see what we have around us. So obviously there's minerals like Osium here to pick up. And I think each planet is different too. So there'll be like snow planets or there'll be different biomes within a planet. So jungles, that type of thing. Let's see, units can move around by holding the right click button. Okay. Now again, I'm going to do a full playthrough on this game if a lot of you like this one too. So we're just jumping in to get dirty and see what we can do. Here we have our transport arc, which seems to be like a floating city. In, in other words, it's like a, a settler to uh, cap uh, settle our capital city. So we're going to find a nice place to build on. This actually will give us a research bonus if we build here, plus farming and a lot of other stuff. So this might be a good place right here to settle our city, although I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a portal to a different planet. Oh, dude, all right, this is a great place to control that. We can go between different planets if we want to. Or I wonder if we could actually go through there right now and literally just go to another planet. I wonder if that'd be possible. But I think we have to settle our city, so I don't think we can actually change our turn. But let's check. Oh, wow, look at this. Our science tech tree is huge. So on this side, we have, like, trading. Down here, we have military. And then on the right side, we have science. And it looks like we have different types of eras as well that give us access to all sorts of different things, including the art of politics, transcendence, and for the people. Well, let's get started. Trade will probably be uh, a very important thing, so I think we've already started that research. So let's do that. And let's head back to the planet then and uh, start going back to whatever we need to do. Oh, here we are. We have all sorts of information on the uh, faction, too. Now, at any time, it can also open the tutorial, so it's not forever lost. If I need help, we can open this back up, but it should be pretty easy. I've played many a uh, city builder game before slash empire builder, so this should be uh, somewhat similar to that. Let's go back to the uh, planet, then. Uh, actually, well, we have different paths. Science, of course, to research, which we've done. Diplomacy, but we haven't found anybody. Oh, we can make our own units. This is great. Hold on a second. Look at this. We can make infantry units, light tanks, artillery. So we have the whole military thing covered, too, if we want to. So we can actually make, like, our own scout vehicles and design them. That's really cool, actually. I must say. Uh, light armored transporter infantry unit. Oh, that's cool. Then we can give them all sorts of different things if we want. But, uh, yeah, let's not do that at the moment. Since we're not going to be very good fighters at the moment. That's really neat. Okay, let's go back and uh, set up our city. Glory. To Raptoria. Are you sure you want to settle Raptoria in this title? Absolutely. All right, let's go ahead and do it. Quest completed. Chapter 1, The Arrival. Settling down our first city was the first step in making a brighter future and our people confident at the start of something truly great. We can't let them down. All right, job done. New quest, Chapter 2, From Hope to Prosperity. Main quest. The citizens of our capital city of Wright, oh, that's an interesting way of misspelling Raptoria, are both terrified and excited of what lies ahead. We can't let them down. We must get to work immediately and show them the way forward. We might not have another chance. Uh, let's see, reach level 3 and right, and advance Path of Bliss by 4. Ah, that must be a condition for victory up here. So we have the Path of Bliss, the Path of Enlightenment, Gaia, and Ember. Interesting. City management uh, techniques and such here. Look at all this data and stuff on the screen. But of course, right now, what we want to do is we want to start farming or um, mining or whatever we need to do. So... Uh, farming probably going to be quite important, so let's get that started first and foremost. And that'll probably be good over here in this district with uh, all this uh, farmland. So let's do farming there. Let's do uh, research in the north, because that gives us a plus two bonus. Uh, and you can see we're building roads between our other uh, buildings within the city, facilities around the city. We could build a military district, but no need to do that at the moment. Let's do another farm down here and let's do a mine as well industrial district here beautiful uh, can we produce anything else at the moment we have no unemployed citizens so I don't think we can build any more buildings let's see can we build a defense district oh we can perfect so we can defend ourselves too excellent fantastic all right we'll get started with that we're down to 12 credits so we won't be able to do anything else with that 
So let's go ahead and uh, return that. Oh, I see what could be maybe some green over here. That could be radioactive. Oh, it's toxic land. Okay. Well, it might be interesting to go over that way. Let's move a unit now. We have our scout unit at our disposal. We saw that earlier. Can I move that thing? Oh, we can move it this way. Cool. Well, let's see if there's some uh, nice land around us somewhere. So this seems to be a desert planet so far, but there is something here we can scout out in our next turn. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh-oh. We have some neighbors nearby. Uh-oh. The Ra Dynasty, who are neutral at us right now. Uh-oh. Ruins found. Our crew has arrived at a destination. We don't know the origin of these ruins, but they appear to be very ancient and might hide valuables. What should we do about them? Search. Uh, we found 300 credits. Fantastic. Beautiful. That'll help us to build more buildings. Can we go establish contact with these folks? They might be going down to that ruin down there. Let's go see if we can sneak up behind them. Can we establish contact? Well, we can't. Oh, this is there's Oh, New Memphis. What the hell? Tennis Tennessee showed up. Oh, what the hell? All right. Well, we got to we got to fight Tennessee now. They're just getting started. We got to take them over. We got to conquer them. All right, let's end the turn. Pharaoh Ramses the uh tw is that 12? Yes. Uh well, wait, what does that say? Hold on. Uh well met, Chancellor Win. May we live in prosperity together. Damn you, Tennessee, hindered at every turn. All right, let's go ahead and see if we can trade with them. Let's see. It looks like we need influence points to do this. So it looks like we don't really have the ability to do anything. But we can uh, immediately declare a diplomatic stance with them. So we could exchange our ways or praise or denounce them. I don't have enough points to do anything. But maybe we can come back later for a formal invitation. Great. Now they have a military building up. Ah, yes. Tennessee. All right, and a shipwreck found. Oh, this looks like ice. So there must be different types of planets that consist of, like, ice and forests and all sorts of different things. It must be randomly generated at the start of each uh, adventure. Our crew has arrived at the destination. The shipwreck appears to have been here for quite some time. What should we do? Let's search. Uh, despite searching around, we couldn't find anything of value. Okay, what is this stuff here? Uh, infested land. Oh. Okay, area to do research. Well, we have uh, another thing over here to research, so let's go do that. We're waiting for these turns to complete, by the way, so that way all of our buildings are done. So we can keep exploring while we're waiting for them to finish up. Didn't we already explore this, by the way? I wonder if we can go back there again. Okay, let's stop at the next thing. Shipwreck found. Go ahead and search. Uh, we found five osseum. That's osseum. Perfect. Fantastic. Uh, Aether anomaly. Uh, let's see. We get a plus point zero. Wow. 0 0.1 Aether per turn if we put that within the city's borders. Okay. Oh, there seems to be something over here, too. Another abandoned pod. Okay. Let's go over there next. Make our turn. Buildings are still a little bit away from being completed. Looks like one more until we finish the farm district, and one more until the trade research is done, too. Escape pod found. Our crews arrived at the destination. The escape pod doesn't appear to be functioning. However, there might be something of value. Search it. Another 300 credits. Hell yeah, we're making a lot of money. We should be up to, uh, oh, we're at 816 credits now. I wonder if we can build uh, anything else while we're waiting. A military academy or a university. Oh. And that'll take four turns to build. Let's build the university. That'll be a good thing. Okay. Uh, let's continue to go south. So I don't know who exactly these people are. It seems to be a variant of Earth or whatnot, but there's other factions that we can battle it out with, and there's other planets for us to fight as well. Like, for example, here we can eventually send out ships to go over to whatever this is and explore it and then battle it out with other uh, planets once we get big enough. It's almost like um, uh, Planetary Annihilation or whatever, where we get to uh, go out to other planets and start battling everyone else once we conquer this planet. So the, the game becomes even bigger the more that we uh, conquer things. Kind of cool. All right, let's end the turn. Trade initiates. Trade is a necessity, and the more the merrier. Merlin Foxwell, Terran Republic Entrepreneur. Increase the corruption threshold by 1,500. Okay. Well, let's continue to roll around. I wonder if we can turn our boat into, I mean, our car into a boat. Let's see if we can go south. There seems to be a lot of mountains here that are separating everything. Oh, this is pretty. Is this like salt or something like that in the water? Uh, set unit to auto explore. I like doing it myself. Skip turn, hold position, destroy the unit, or view the unit's design. Ah, 
So this is the unit that we saw before. Let's rename this one to the uh, Raptor 1. Excellent. Cool. Wait, what? It'll cost money to... Wait, hold on a second. Oh, this is how much it, it takes to build a new one each time. Uh, this updated design is unchanged from the previous version. No, it's not. I renamed it. Maybe it'll keep the name. Let's see. Wait, where's our uh, car? Scout. Oh, I didn't change the name. Well, that's lame. Okay, well, let's go to... Uh, let's do m maybe military stuff next. Battle engineers? That sounds like a good thing since we're next to our uh, our neighbors there. We at least want to protect ourselves. And let's see if we can go down here. Is there anything I can do to go out into the water? Oh, it looks like we might be able to. We've already gone down there before. Let's go back this way. Let's explore along the coast and end our turn. Okay, so the next thing is... Oh, what is this? Current number of cities we control and the current limit. So we can build another city. So maybe we better do that. Financial district, defense, military. Uh, maybe we can build another one. Wow, look at all this complexity here, too. We have one citizen, but we have no unemployed. Prosperity is five. Growth. Looks like things are looking good. Pollution is minimal. Good traits. We have a capital, and population is confident in us. Beautiful. Looks like our city will grow the more stuff that we supply. So we're still waiting on the farms and things like that, so they can eventually grow. I wonder if we can build a financial district on the mountain. No? Okay. Farming? No. Okay, we can't build on the mountains, then. Okay, let's continue to roll. Ooh, can we go in the water? Oh, that's sweet. We've become like a little uh, patrol boat or something like that. A scout. Nice. I like that. Okay, let's end our turn. Uh-oh, it's trouble nearby. Uh, the other little scout cars nearby. They seem peaceful so far, so let's kind of just be chill with them. Oh, it looks like we can only move one in the water, but multiple on land. So if we go into boat mode, it seems to just be able to cross... Uh, bodies of water. So that's helpful to get across like a small lake or a river. But that's about it. Oh, it looks like Memphis knows something's over here. Looks like a building was complete. One of the farms is done. Over there by the other side. So that's good. That one there is done. Oh, what are these? Buried bones. Planetary landmark. I wonder if we can go pick those up or something like that. We'll keep trying to explore more uh, points of interest. Can we also build the military academy? Ah, oh, yeah, let's do that too then. Well, we certainly have the money to do it, so I may as well do that. Let's continue to go this way. I'm now actually more interested in exploring than anything else to see what things look like in the game. Are these the edges of the map, maybe? It looks like this kind of surrounds the entire... Uh, it seems like there's an ocean, but it doesn't let me go any further than what looks to be like salt or something. More salt than uh, players playing Call of Duty. Battle Engineers. Let's see, we have an ISO Missile Launcher and a Sunstorm Phaser. Hmm. Looks like we've also advanced the Path of Ember by three. So that's going to be like a victory through a warfare or something like that. So that might be a good thing to go to since we're starting next to somebody. I don't know if I trust them yet, but we'll see. Choose Research. Hmm. Let's see. Technocrat. Crassy. Uh, you know what? If we're going to fight somebody, let's go for city defense systems. Let's get our defenses up first so we know we can defend ourselves against the uh, inevitable. Even if it's not the um, the Tennesseans, I guess. I don't know what you would call them. But uh, even if it's those guys, they're kind of like Egyptians since they call one of their person like a pharaoh. But the planet could also attack us too. There could be bugs and who knows. What is that? Oh, another plant there. Okay, let's keep going. The world actually so far reminds me a lot of... Uh, Wow, it looks like a dried-up ocean, that giant fish-looking thing over there. The world reminds me a lot of Satisfactory so far, the desert area of that. Oh, there's Tennessee over there. Uh-oh, Tennessee's getting attacked by something called an Ichalus. Creature level 1 can do 30 damage. Whoa. Uh, and also can make two moves and see two spaces. Oh, boy, Tennessee, good luck. Good luck to you, dude. Um, okay, so it looks like a second building is up. Oh, we have no population to work this. And let's see how we get a po uh, person to work then. What does this say? Controlled by the Terran Republic, the district doesn't have a citizen and thus is an active. Okay. Probably get citizens soon. Well, let's keep on exploring. That's what I'm a little bit more interested in right now. Oops. Whatever popped up, I was right-clicking to move. Oh, boy. Oh, what are the... Oh, God, no. Verni Verner... Ver Vermium workers. Ooh, those guys do a lot of damage, too. So there's something else on this planet. And it's icky. 
All right, good thing we're getting that city defense up. I'm gonna need that. Okay, let's get back to uh, let's get back to everything at hand. Edicts and leadership, of course. There, there's a lot of detail to this game. Again, we're purposely skipping it. Otherwise, it'll be a book reading simulator. And we'll get to that at, at some point. There's a lot to respect in this game, but I am purposely skipping it just to see. So we're going to be missing a lot unless we... Oh, oh boy. Hi. <laughs> Uh-oh. Ew, they're like little ticks. Well, that's bad. We're down to, like, no health now. 26 out of 60. we got to get out of here. Well, let's, let's haul the other way. Goodbye. Oh, what is that thing? Good thing we didn't go right. A slust. 50 damage. Oh my god, everything wants us dead now. Okay, good thing we're building ourselves uh, some defenses right away. We gotta get that military defense district up. Alright, end the turn. Hopefully they don't chase us. Oh god, oh ew, ew, that's gross. What is that? No. Dear god, no. I'm gonna go back home. Is there a way I can repair this thing? Maybe. Oh, wait, there's an option right there to repair. Recover one RD of the unit's total health every turn. Okay, well, we're going back home. Let me get away from that thing. Maybe it'll leave us alone. Looks like the industrial district was just completed. How do we get more citizens going? Uh, build queue. I guess the best way to get a population up is just to feed them and tell them to, you know, get down and jiggy with it, I suppose. As we were told by William Smith in the 90s. Okay, it looks like they've left me alone. Let's go ahead and repair this unit. So we'll put them on repair now for a little while. Whew. Okay. I wonder if we can actually go back to some of these things. We've already explored the abandoned pod, but it kind of shows me that there's still something there. Maybe we should teleport to another planet, although I don't know if I want to do that just yet. Well, let's go ahead and uh, continue to explore and repair. Well, we can build a settler now. Ah, that's what we want. Oh, it takes a citizen, though, to do that. I don't think we can actually do that. Ah, maybe we can. All right, now we can go settle some other cities, so that's going to be good. We have nobody unemployed, but that's another thing. Uh, go to next city with unemployed citizens. Go to next city. Okay, so we can build multiple cities here. We can see all of our notifications. We're building those defenses. And our current goal will be completed as soon as we get all those requirements done. We're at 4 out of 8 influence. So I suppose as we have more things built, we'll get ourselves some more, uh... Oh, wow. Level 1 city. Ah, the city will grow in four turns, and then we'll get another citizen. Nice. Nice. 69 turns. I suppose that'll increase as we provide the citizens with more than needs. Things like food and whatnot. Looks like they're all building stuff, but nobody's actually working yet, but that's fine. Pharaoh Ramses, wasting time and resources rediscovering what you've already discovered is a futile effort. I'm willing to trade, get trade initiates from you for 85 credits. Do you agree? Uh, let's see. Check the proposal deals. Proposal value. Can I adjust this? No. Go back. Let's go ahead and just accept the deal then. I, I'll be at peace with them so far. So basically, we gave them free information on how to do the trade initiates. So that's good. Okay. Let's continue to end our turn. And it looks like this vehicle is actually fully functional. So let's go back to... Let's see another planet then. Oh, it looks like it just finished repairing. Leadership change is now available. Ooh, cool. Authorize slavery. Implement... Uh, prepare war effort, free health care, deliver speech on natural preservation. Mm, increases prosperity every day. Hmm. What one gives us the most citizens? Path Path of Gaia plus three. Change. R right now we're bureaucratic. Liberty. Uh, authority. Pragmatism. Uh, hmm. Active edicts, past edicts, or show all edicts. Well, uh, let's see. I would like to probably do the... Pr the. Well, this increases prosperity in every city we control by plus one. That seems like a good thing. Let's do that. I'd like to have more prosperity. So let's do that. It'll cost us five credits, but we have plenty. So that's good. All right, let's end our turn. Build queue. Military academy's going up next. Nice. Okay, things are good here. 
Alright, let's try to explore another planet. I want to see what's going on at a different planet. Oh, we now control that. Our city is actually naturally expanded, too. Beautiful. Soon. We can't land portals yet. Oh, well, that's dumb. <laughs> eh, that's okay. We can't use them yet, but we will be able to soon. 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 Well, it looks like Tennessee has uh, explored up there a little bit. Oh, what is this? Uh-oh. Oh, great. Tennessee now has a military tank up. Great. My arch nemesis. The state of Tennessee. Okay, let's see. I guess we'll go north. City defense systems. We have successfully finished our research of the city defense systems. The best offense is a good defense. King Duacy. Uh, well, I think Winston Churchill said the opposite, but uh, the best defense is a good offense, but yeah. Okay. I think maybe. Somebody said it. Oh, wow. They've got... What is going on over here? They've got light armor being pumped out like crazy. Wow, that's cool. We should probably do the same then. But uh, let's try to go for more trading and stuff. Maybe we can actually trade with them. Robot farmers, pragmatic thinkers, anti-corruption... Uh, ooh, renewable energy. What will that give us? Path of Gaia by three. Well, we're doing. We're going down Path of Ember. It seems really quickly now. Path of Bliss by three for robot farmers, though. Um, decreases every district's pollution, or uh, increases food production by one. That seems like a good idea. Then we can use our labor force to do other things. So let's try that, and we'll check that out in a few turns. Oh, can I build anything else? Ah, city defense system. Let's build one of those. Defend us from Tennessee. Pinto's natural habitat. Oh, God, no! Oh, boy. Okay, Ramses, can you defend us, dude? We gave you tech. Can you blow them to heck? Oh, God, I don't want anything to do with that thing. Gross. I want to try to go as far south as I can. Oh, I can't really, like, maneuver around some of this stuff. Oh, boy. Well, he might go near their tanks, but maybe if I go near my city, it w will be defended. Let's let's retreat. He like followed us all the way back here. Okay. Well, like we can't leave home. I could go south and try to sneak over this way, but we got to get through those mountains. Let's try to go this way. Maybe those military tanks up there will go to battle with them. They must be fighting him by now. Okay, let's see. Robot farms in seven turns. Looks like our military is actually working. Oh, it's actually being built. No option currently available. Okay. Well, let's see. Well, the city actually has expanded. So we could build a defense district here. Another one. Oh, but there's actually good territory up there for other things. Uh, let's see. Pollution, negative three, by being connected to another planet. Are we just literally dumping our garbage into that thing? Military district. Let's build that there. We'll build a military district now. Maybe we can start pumping out units. And let's try to explore this way. I think we've already gone to this craft, but let me see what happens if we go again. Oh, I see. It's no longer highlighted. It shows you that as a point of interest, but no longer uh, can be used. I'm actually just really enjoying just zooming around and looking at stuff on the map. Let's take a look at Memphis again. Oh, they're going all military, dude. They just straight up just went straight military, defense and military right away. Okay. Maybe we can work together to destroy the enemy. Soon. Soon. Okay, what else can we do? Financial districts. I'll need more space for that as soon as the city grows. In another 45 turns. Wow. Wow. We can also see tile yields, too, so it'll show us where it's beneficial to farm. Oh, yeah, we got a real good beneficial one down there. Nice. Okay, let's end our turn again. Let's try to get out of here. Go explore more of the world. Oh, God, more creatures? Oh, man. They're everywhere. Gross. Okay, I just want to see the planet. Oh, boy. Ew. Okay, let's go north. Another building seems ready. And another portal off the planet. Alright. 
So as soon as this thing is done, we should be able to make more scouts or military units. Oh, this thing actually fires artillery, so if anything comes close to the city, we're defended. So it's like a giant artillery cannon. Cool. Building settlers, so we'll be able to settle another city in nine turns. So let's continue to explore and find where we want to put the second one. Although I'd like to actually have an interesting fight with uh, Tennessee to see how that works. Oh, God, another city. Oh, man. All right. King King du, du, Dushi. He's gesturing us and trying to say something. However, we cannot understand anything he's saying. We need to study their language before we can communicate. Uh, we would like to... Oh, God, 25 turns to figure this out? It would cost us five influence to praise them. Hmm. We could become friends with them, though. But what's the difference between first contact and declare friendship? How would they know the difference between those two? Okay. Well, let's come back later. Wow, they got a lot of military. Everybody's not messing around with this. Okay. We're now negative nine credits, so I'm hoping we can get money by doing trade or something like that eventually. Or by just selling things to our own city. But regardless, I just want to see how things look and feel. And what we can do with the other nations. Is this the edge of the map? It seems like it's just a small island. Oh, it is. Okay, you can see where the map kind of ends here. So we can't go too far, but what we can do is go to other planets. So to conquer a planet, it's easy. But to conquer a universe is hard. Raptor 2020. All right, let's end our turn. I want to see what the other factions look like then. The fact that we can design our own units, though, and have them all look different, tank-wise or uh, maybe boat-wise, is pretty sweet, actually. Okay, six more turns, then we get a settlement. Our structured settlement. That'll be great. Robot farmers. Food production output increased by one. All right, let's see if we can do something to increase our money. We're going broke. Not a Raptor video without that, but for our first look, it's not that big of a deal. Let's see. What would this do for us? Increase knowledge by one. Hmm. Oh, Mega Labs. Path of Enlightenment plus three. Probably a good idea to round all these skills out. It might benefit us in the long run. Technomancers, hardened alloys. Let's do technocracy to get started. Techno... Yeah, whatever. You know what I'm trying to say. Let's go explore a little bit more in our Ford Explorer. Explorer? Damn near killed her. Oh, we can't cut through these cities, though. Even if they're neutral, it doesn't look like we can pass through their territory. I like how this uh, town is called Solus. Uh, we're looking to buy th uh, Osseum 3 of it, to be exact. We're willing to pay 405 credits. Oh, well, there we go. There's our money deal. Got lucky, Raptor. You sure did. Sounds like a deal we accept. Where's our Osseum? How can I see that? Aether. Research. Ah, there it is. Five. Uh, Osseum, we'll just call it Awesome, is a mineral with unique properties that can be used for a variety of purposes. Most notably, to power military equipment like ray weapons. Oh, great. Great. Well, I need money, so cool. There you go. Thank you. Well, great. Now they're powering death rays to destroy us. First they wanted to trade, now they want to kill. Let's go further this way. I'm interested to see, like, is this water? Or is this, like, liquid mercury? I don't know what that is. Seems like not a lot of things have lived very long on this planet, if at all. Let's try to go up that way next. Okay, three more turns and we've finished our research. And we'll get our settlers soon, too. Ah, oh, yet another city. The P city of Pizza. I mean, Raza. Can we establish contact? Guess not. All right, and we have three more turns for a settler. Chieftain uh, Aizon. He's gesturing us. Okay, never mind. Hmm. This is a forest. Interesting. So it just gives you different types of resources. I love the music here. It's not all like um, scientific-y and cyberpunk-y all the time. Sometimes it's just a nice, gentle piano. It's very nice. Ooh, not very nice. What the hell is that? Corn on the cob? Look at that. They look like corn on the cob with legs. Oh, it's the Venium work. Oh, what is that? Oh, God. A grabber nest? What the hell? Creasers will spawn... And try to defend it from any perceived threats at all costs. Oh, great. Hopefully they can't jump or come across here or go over here. Ooh. I can see why everybody's building up a military now. Everything here is scurry. I don't want anything to do with that. Let's choose research. I'm All right. Build things to 
kill good good dead. Kill good dead. Go. Armored warfare. We're switching to military. Forget this. Way too many gross bugs. Oh, gross. I don't know if they can swim. Uh, what was that? Oh, military thing must have been complete. Uh, let's get the hell out of here. Going south. Goodbye. Hmm, another crash site. We'll go there next. And more osseum here. If I drive up to this, does it auto-gather it? I'll need to check that out. I've forgotten if I've already discovered that. Okay, city defense system is up. And look at this. We have ourselves a settler. So we can go settle another city now. Um... Where would be a good city? It seems like in the south we haven't found too much trouble. Um, although we want to be somewhat uh, further away from the other city. So let's just move this way. I don't want to use that thing just yet. But we'll go this way. Yes, what brings you here today? Uh, oh, I don't know, actually. Can we declare a friendship? I appreciate your declaration of friendship. Oh, cool. I'm glad we're friends now. Cool. Cool. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to drop by your house. So all we have to do is click on their territory and we get to go chat with them. How do I see my next unit? Probably a button for that in the tutorial. I'm sure they've covered something like that. Let's check out what's at this wreck. Oh, God. The crazy scientist! A crazy scientist has been working on an aether-based bomb that could potentially destroy an entire planet. He's too early in his research to be of any immediate danger. However, we should act sooner than later. Arrest him and burn his research. Forbid him continuing, but let him go. Attempt to learn something about his research. Let's do that. Sounds like a good option. Okay, let's move our uh, city builder over. Well, there certainly seems to be a lot of stuff over here for building. Hmm. And there's two for mining there. And there's two for farming here. Let's continue to work our way east. All right, let's go back to our scout unit and see if we can go Oops, down to this. Shipwreck found again, and we found 300 credits. Seems to be quite useful to go to those things. Now let's see if we can discover some of this stuff. I think if we just drive to this, we can actually pick it up, so that's good. They might want to buy more of that from us in the future. Okay, more farming, more research. Lots of research here. I think what I'm going to do is set up the city here and then set up research and mining sites around it. We'll need that if we're going to start pumping out military units. So that's how we'll go about that. Let's go to end our turn. Oh, gross. Whoa! Uh, gain the terrified status. What the hell does that mean? Did it just cloak itself? What's going on? Scout is under attack and... Yeah. yeah. Wow, we're being chased now. Time to get the hell out of here. Goodbye. Gross. We might lose that scout soon. But the main goal is to build a city here. Now, is this pollution? Hmm. All right, let's build a new city. Do you want to settle a city in this tile? Yes. And this is the city of Orwell. Cool. All right, let's immediately start by getting some farming up. And also some... Mining or research? Let's go for mining. Not enough funds. Okay. All right. Let's go for ending our turn. Now, the good news is we're about to get armored warfare soon. Oh, sounds like they were going to war up there. City defense is getting completed, too. Ah, wonderful. Looks like the military district's almost complete. Wonder if the turrets are automatic. Looks like this might need to be mined instead of just picked up by a scout. But again, there's the whole tutorial on it as well. Lengthy and beefy. We'll have to give that a shot at some point. But we've done good so far. We've explored a majority of the planet. Oh, God. Oh, God. We're dead. Wait, is there a way to undo that? Order this unit to be scrapped. <laughs> We may as well, huh? Well, we're dead. 
Uh, well, at least these guys have tanks around, so they can't come out too far for us. So basically what the goal is, is first explore the map, explore, explo exploit as many resources as you can, then start cutting down on the alien life forms here that threaten our existence, and then try to take more territory, and then battle it out or ally with these guys to go conquer other planets. Seems pretty good. Let's see what happens if a unit gets destroyed. Although, uh, we need to start making a light armor. Those guys must have started research with, uh, that right away. Let's end our turn here. And that is gone, baby. That thing is dead. Or is it not? Wait, did it have a shield? Oh, I thought it was dead. Good. Okay, let's flee. Getting the heck out of here. Let's heal up. Looks like our military districts are being expanded upon. I'll have to figure out how to do things with citizens, too, but... Again, this is just a first look, so I'm not too concerned. I just want to get my feet wet. And it seems like, uh... Clothing's gonna be wet with blood soon. Uh-oh. No, you don't. Farming district and right is complete. One more until we finish the armored warfare research. I want to see what happens when these guys try to come over here. Can I turn that off? Nope. Wow, they didn't go for those guys, Scout? Oh, they're going for me. Ah, there we are. Armored Warfare. Good, now we can actually start building some reinforced tanks and stuff. These guys are being real jerks. Can I move this thing? Might not be able to because we're healing. 48 out of 60. That'll allow me to escape now, but we have our military district up, so we might be able to uh, start building stuff on this. We also have research now to do. Ah, study Corvus communication. That'll help us to start uh, communicating with our neighbor. Let's do that, that other guy down the road. Let's do that. Okay, four turns for that one. Uh, what can we do in the city? Can we order military construction? Build queue. Trading goods. Rename this city, damn right. Excellent. Raptoria it is. Beautiful. Okay, what else is there? Manage the city automation policies. Rename city or raise the city. Uh, focus. No automation. Uh, let's do industry focused. Budget. Uh, unlimited, I guess. Big? I don't know. Looks like you can do auto, though. That's kind of cool when you're managing, like, 15 cities across, like, three planets or something. That's kind of neat. And let's call this one, uh, let's see. Yes, become a member today. Confirm. All right. Excellent. Oh, look at this. We're actually getting plus two farming. Plus three mining. Probably from the uh, bonuses around us, maybe. Doesn't, doesn't matter, but it looks beautiful. Cool. All right, let's see if our unit gets destroyed in the next turn. Oh, tanks are engaging. Yeah. Hell yeah. That tank did a good job. Nice. Thank you very much, uh, Memphis. Appreciate that. Sweet. Okay, let's try going south now. We'll return to the main city and start working south. Looks like we're going to need uh, guns at all the outposts because these guys could come in from any direction. Folks, that's going to be my time here today for this wonderful game. If you want to go ahead and smash like, we'll be back to play some more sometime. So I'll see you all very soon. I hope you all enjoyed I like this game. I like city builders. I like exploration games like this. And we've only barely even just scratched the surface. So, I'll see you all next time. Thank you very much for being here. And we'll see you soon. Goodbye, everybody. Enjoy your day. And we'll see you soon.